Taylor is uh, on the line now to speak to us, of course, about his new appointment and so much more. Coach, congratulations. I feel like every time I talk to you, I'm congratulating you. <laughs> <laughs> I can count the amount of times I've called you to say congratulations. Yeah, maybe it's a good thing. It is, but I also know that, you know, you hate not being, as anybody would, not being at work. But uh, at the same time, Coach, you know, you're now at work somewhere where I didn't think I'd see you so often. How did the Marumo thing happen? Yeah, well, um, first of all, I, I I spoke to the president at the PLA and to you know to tell him uh, my my intentions, you know. So and 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 then uh, yeah, when, when we agreed, then I decided that when when this opportunity came, let me just take it. I had a brief uh, chat with the chairman. Um, over in the past weekend, it was just before the weekend, and uh, then we have returned and, and I decided, no, let, let me go to my room. Coach, you know, the, the, the co-coaching thing has become something that is uh, in our league, something that we're seeing, and when it happened there again, we weren't surprised because it's something that we become accustomed to. When you took the job as well, I mean, I several people, including myself, I think, asked you about the co-coaching. Speaking to the president at um, Royal AM now, she says your reasons for wanting to leave Royal AM was because you weren't happy with the co-coaching. Yeah, I said, you know, when, when, when I agreed to do the co-coaching, I thought it's something that will work, you know. And um, um, not known to me, but there are inner things in me that would really plague me. You know, uh, and and because I felt that uh, what am I doing? Am I doing justice to the brand Ben Malisena? You know, who has always been standing alone. Am I am I not going to damage that? You know, and in in the interim while I was at early I felt maybe I am, and I had a strong feeling to say, you know, I shouldn't do this, and I w- I would not be fair to Royal AM to to go and and give them my. my a divided attention. You know. Maybe, maybe, coach. And I mean, we don't understand from a, a fans of the game point of view when you say that you know it's divided attention and it wasn't working. Isn't co-coaching as what we would think? Two people, three people, in some instances that sit together, come up with something that works and agree on it and move forward. So, if you're saying that you think that you are going to be tarnishing the brand Dan Malasella, please just uh, help me understand what that means. Yeah, what that means is that um, it has always been a, a, a standalone, and now um, every time the brand is mentioned, it is mentioned within a group. Mm. So that, that that brand will then go away and become something else that is within a group. So it wasn't that the co-coaching wasn't working. You guys weren't amicable. No, 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 no. We, we no, we we, we 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 were okay. You know, we were okay. Yes, obviously we will have debate over issues and whatever, but that will be done, dealt with uh, very well. But I, I was looking at the interest of Ben Manicella and saying, are you, are you really helping the, the, the interest of, of, of Ben Manicella or are you, are you not? You know, I'm associated with seven things and all of that. And it, 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 it became so difficult for me to really justify uh, that I'm representing Ben Manasseh. Let me understand you, Coach. Is it that some decisions are going to get made because it's a co-coaching and they're not necessarily going to be your decisions and you're not always going to be happy about it and you can't stand behind that? No, 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 no. no. It wasn't about that. It wasn't about that because um, I'm, I'm one who's very vocal, you know, and I will say things. But I'm talking as in me being used to being this that I am, as in Ben Manasseh, you know, as in the coach, Ben Manasseh, and being alone. Maybe I'm selfish with that, you know, and and maybe I couldn't adjust to that, but I I want the representation of a Ben Manasseh, and, and that's it. Coach, this is, it was very interesting to me. How do you coach your boss how do i how do you coach how are you a coach like how does you know and this is just from a, an interest point of view andile pisane is essentially the chairman of the club <laughs> and essentially your boss how do you coach your boss <laughs> uh, like any other player
Je, like, like any other, like any other place. So he comes to training, puts in as much work. Is just another one of those players. If one of those, if one of those, if coach you Tugana, you Tugana, Naguche. It doesn't really matter. When he's on the field, he's in 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 our territory. So he put in the work and elevated himself to make it on your bench, your guys as co-coaches' decision. Yes, we, we, we see it, we discuss lineups, we, we then present them, we, we, we make uh, relevant people aware of the club, say this is what we're going with, and, and that's it, you know, uh, and the change like anybody else does. And you know, Coach, one of the reasons that my my spirit was a little dampened when you left Royal AM is because I remember you saying to me that as Dan Malasela, what you'd like one day is to get a coach, a, a job where you've got resources, where you've got all the assistance so that you can also not have to start at the bottom. And I thought this was that club for you. Yeah, yeah. You know, I, I, I said so as well. And make no mistake, I was, I was treated very, very well in the club. Mm. Uh, very, very well. You know, if you if you if just look at where I stayed within the within the range, you know, and and how we were taken care of, you know, uh, somebody would be saying to me, "I'm crazy," you know, <laughs> but uh, yeah, me being me with my thinking, uh, I'm where I am. And then you go back to a place where the parting of the two clubs wasn't great. When you left Marumo Gallants, you guys couldn't find each other. What changed? Uh, look, I, did, um, I have learned that you know, um, in, in football you don't you don't transfers and you don't bend bridges and you, you don't do anything because anything can happen at any time. Um, but the, one of the biggest reasons I went back is that the majority of the players um, I had last season are still there. Mm. You know, that's what I'm saying. I need to look at this brand to say where can it work. You know, and and from you know the session we had today, you know, you could tell the excitement, you could tell the interest. Uh, of the players, you could see the interest of the players, and it just says volumes to 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 my decision. And that's all good and well, Dan. And I'm pretty sure they're happy to have you. And like I said in my opening, you know, even majority of South Africans always want to see a Dan Malisela that's uh, employed because they love the kind of football that he brings into 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 our DSTV Premiership. But then I wonder about administrative issues that you of the reasons that you, you left in the first place. How much of that did you sit down with the chair and say, hey, this was the issues before. Uh, I wasn't happy. You weren't happy with this. And this is why we parted ways. How do we then fix that so that it's different this time so that we don't have another Dan Dance and Chipper United situation with the up and downs in the same team? Yeah, we spoke about that. You know, my, 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 my wife uh, was there as well. So, um... Also, that I, I needed my wife's representation because I feel that she she's the one who who uh, really knows what I go through deeply, you know, and she understands. She understands the football now. She's teaching herself. So I, I just said to her, "Look, let's go together so that." Even if whatever happens, you know, whatever contractual issues we we, we, we must decide on, she she must be a part of it. In 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 in, in a few ways, it, it simply means that I, I I just wanted to manage some of my my, my issues. And what uh, what kind of contract did the tag team of the Malisela household come up with? Well, it, it, it's two years plus an option, you know, for for the other season, you know, depending. Well, coach, you've started. Um, when was your first day today? I think, or was it yesterday? This week? I arrived yesterday, and uh, you know, we we started today. Yeah, and today was very good. 
Well, Coach, all the very best, and thank you so much for always making time. Well, thank you so much, Andy. Be- before I let you go, Dan, before I let you go, just uh, popped in now. How long was your contract with uh, Royal AM? Uh, let me think quickly. Um, it was supposed to be, I think it was two years and, 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 and an option as well. What do you mean it was oh, supposed uh, to be? Uh, what do you I, mean it was I supposed to be? I think, yeah, because it's not. <laughs> because it's not there anymore. But you did have a contract that you signed. No, 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 no. We, 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 we were supposed to sign. We, we had agreed and we had paper done, paper was done. So you just hadn't signed yet? Mm. I just hadn't signed yet. Okay. Coach, I mean, it's not the first we're hearing something like this, Coach. And if anybody understands contract, you know, it's up and down, up and down until we both agree on everything. So it's, it's not that much of a big issue, really.